Good evening, welcome back to In The Court. This is November 2nd, 2022. It's a little too close. Also, there is this weird line coming from here. I do not know why. Uh, there's nothing which has changed in the setup. Or maybe it's on the lens. Okay, I don't know. I don't have time to worry about it. <laughs> Go through the day. So, 2nd November, woke up at 6. The time from getting up to taking snowy down has pretty much been a drag city lately. Bruh. Post that, I feel kind of alright once I have eaten the oatmeal. So, I have to like, the morning schedule, like stretching meditation, it's like, I just want to sleep. <laughs> but thank God, I have this beautiful motivation in my life, whose name is Snowy. <laughs> uh, that pushes me to be like, okay, no, no matter what, just get up, get the basic thing done. And if you want, you can sleep later. But that later, you just basically feel all right you know, after having done so much activity. So then things just work out, which is amazing. But regardless, today I decided to treat myself post the extra hustle it took last night till late getting the Halloween video plus the IT carried out. So I was working until 12 yesterday night. Now I need to get back the sculpting course now and then the long running plan of click reflect animations once I'm able to make custom characters and rig them. Here's an interesting fact. Small things I've learned are very useful small nuggets. I can I can myself find benefit from them sometimes. I mean there is obviously this thing that and this is the, the trend for all in the code videos in general that a lot of the times I am revisiting the things that I had done just to revise whatever it is. So of course there is a secondary benefit of if somebody searching or somebody subscribing out of nowhere they can benefit from something that I learned that particular day in real time and I don't have to like wait to make a script and then make a video on the main channel or something Bruh. but even for shorts because as a matter of fact it is on the in the code blog that those shorts or small things I've learned ideas have come up so it just makes complete sense for those shorts or short form videos to go on in the code channel only so what I have to do is I have to maybe dedicate a weekend to recording like 20 or 15 or 20 such short videos from small things I've learned and then keep uploading it as shorts on in the code channel which is amazing because I've been putting shorts on the main channel and one thing which is very different about shorts than as compared to regular videos on the channel is the reach is very kind of steep sometimes like a lot of views just come in out of nowhere through the shorts feed or whatever so that is like a good thing to take advantage of because once that happens and once someone has seen that video and subscribed to the channel they also see your main channel videos in that case so then it just becomes like a cohesive system and everything seems to work out so that's that's the plan 12.53 resuming work now the three-year video for the agency wasn't priority the entire day was spent doing that it was like super stressful because a ton of after effects templates and taking all the content that we have putting it in those templates and for god's sake the people who make those templates do not even rename the layers it's all shape layer 1 to shape layer 56 Bruh. and i have to like individually unhide and hide those layers and figure out what layer is what so that was that entire struggle today but i think in the end i kind of managed to do pretty well by tomorrow eod i have to give this video and i think i should be in a position to pull that off other than that today like weirdly enough and it's not weirdly enough every single month i'm facing this problem that the adobe uh, payment details just throw up and it is so annoying i cannot go about explaining how annoying this is so what i did is i quickly just put the other card details in there the amount for adobe subscription got deducted and then later i'm getting the stupid notification that oh your domestic something is not enabled so now the situation is that the 2400 rupees that i go that goes for adobe subscription every month has gone from my account but i'm still seeing that stupid billing issue like it's right here avoid losing access to your softwares and uh, if it was just this pop-up and you have to dismiss it that's okay but i feel like there are some weird issues like it won't export or it won't do the dynamic link why why adobe why are you like this why can't you even be like a fraction like blender I mean, just learn something from blender and i'm not saying don't charge money but at least don't do stupid stuff like this like when when someone is paying money don't just for no reason make their card details invalid or whatever nonsense anyway that was that rant with adobe we're under five minutes i'm gonna actually stop here because i am like super super late i didn't say the time right it must have been seven five minutes it's 7 42 i'm super late again i'll be in the gym at 8 30 and this is becoming a consistent thing so 6 30 i have to anyhow document this session so that i'm in a position to be in the gym at 8 p.m which again today is not gonna happen so that's the thing again that happened because i was working on the video and all the other full-time job stuff as far as dad's work is concerned i did not do anything because obviously did not get any time Bruh. it's just like a while back i put this on the on the video group that now we're gonna do a daily video 
referencing exercise because I need to see references coming in from people so that they are challenging themselves they are sharpening their skills and doing doing stuff better than what they are just doing because that's a very important part of the process so we're just having like a discussion on that anyway thanks so much for being in the court I will catch you tomorrow peace